big happy 2018 to every single one of you. I hope that you all had a great holiday surrounded with all your loved ones. It was a very bittersweet holiday for me and my family. My grandpa who was literally my dad, the one who raised me from when I was a baby, even up till now, he passed away on Christmas day. And although it was a sad occasion, I truly, I can truly honestly tell you guys that I have witnessed a lot of great miracles and just surrounded by a lot of love. And so as much as it was a sad time, it was also one of the best Christmas that I have ever had. So in honor of my grandpa, I am dedicating this video to him. This is a DIY floral painting that you can all do at home. You can host a paint night and you can instruct because it's such a very easy thing to follow. I also wanna mention that I'll be bringing back a lot of DIY wedding ideas for all of you this year. Not just DIYs from my own wedding, but mostly for all of you. So be sure to stay tuned for that. Also, if you haven't already, be sure that you subscribe to this channel and let's get going to this tutorial. To start off, these are the colors that I'm going to be using. You can also use any other colors that you want, but I just got my acrylics from the dollar store. I am using an old canvas and I just put a little bit of gesso in there, but I will be covering it all in black paint. So it didn't matter if the gesso didn't cover the previous paint that it had. Up next for a little guideline, I'm just using a pencil to draw in all the outlines that I'm going to be painting on the canvas. And now to start painting, we're going to take a medium sized flat brush and we are just going to paint all the biggest flowers first. We're going to dip that same brush into a little bit of red so that it blends in with the white and creates kind of like a pinkish color just like you see here. And we're going to paint a little bit of the accent flowers. Now with a medium sized round brush we are just going to paint some of the flowers that are circular and some of the leaves and vines that are a little bit more detailed in which the flat brush just couldn't shape. We're going to wash that brush off and we're just going to mix a little bit of gray. Now this gray is what we're going to use to create a little bit more of definition in our bigger flowers and also some of our leaves. You can also use a little bit of the red just to contrast the colors and to just give it a little bit more life. Finally, with a small thin brush, we are going to use that to do all of the fine details and we're just going to use it to highlight some of the leaves and also the flowers and just make it pop a little bit more with the white acrylic paint. When you're done, you can clean up the background with some more black paint and you can add more flowers or more vines. This is totally an expression of what you're feeling at the moment, so there's no right or wrong way to do it. that and I hope that you try it if you do if you are recreating this painting make sure that you tag me on my Instagram or my Facebook I would love to see all of your recreations don't forget to subscribe also comment down below tell me about your holidays and I would love to connect with each and every single one of you give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one bye